draw. It's just a combination of shapes that eventually turn into a character. Um, and I've been drawing my own stories about my own life since I was, you know, 10 or 11 years old. So I've gotten pretty good at drawing myself in that time. Um, so people always ask me what my favorite character to draw is, and I'm like, is it weird to say me? Because it's true. Um, <laughs> that's awkward, but it's the truth. So that's the easiest character for me to draw. And then, of course, I have lots of other characters from my other books. And uh, over the years, I have gotten better at drawing these characters quickly, too. So Cat is the character who I've been drawing the most lately. And Cat always looks just a little bit worried, but you can see that so many of the shapes are the same yeah. as uh, drawing myself, as drawing these other characters. And you know what? They both have striped shirts. Oh, geez. <laughs> I love drawing striped shirts on characters. It's really fun. And uh, I'm going to give all of these drawings to the school, so you guys can all share them together. And then, of course, there is Maya, who's Kat's little sister. And yeah, they've got the same head shape, they've got the same nose. But Maya's the one who's always really, really, really excited. So I, I like to draw her, like, screaming. <laughs> she's usually making a lot of noise. And um, like I said, she's kind of inspired by an actual cousin of mine who had cancer. And uh, Maya doesn't have cancer, she has cystic fibrosis, which affects her breathing, and yet she is kind of like this unstoppable force. And people want to know why I chose to write about cystic fibrosis, and it's because there's a theme. Breathing is something everybody does, but Maya's not very good at it because her lungs don't work very well. And Kat is not as good at it because she suffers from anxiety, so she often needs to be told to stop and take a deep breath. So thematically, it made sense. And because I was writing uh, fiction and I was writing fantasy, I could sort of make up my own mythology there. So with ghosts, I decided, well, of course, ghosts can't breathe either. So um, they get really excited by, by Maya and Kat because they have breath in them. They have life in them. So 